I will start the computer from the Windows 7 DVD and I'm pressing F11 to show the boot menu the disk is already active inside there and that's the boot menu okay and the second one is the optical drive HLDTST okay so press enter on that one now the computer is starting press any key to boot from CD or DVD I just press enter I don't do anything here and it will automatically uh, activate the first one the computer is starting from the Windows 7 installation kit which is on that DVD it's an external USB optical drive Windows is loading files okay and on this screen I should go here to next but for some reason the mouse is not working maybe some drivers are missing so I'm going to use the tab key on the keyboard and now that one is active so press enter to go to next okay and go here to repair your computer the same thing I have to press the tab key tab now that one is active because it's underlined and press enter system recovery it's searching for Windows installations I also have a Windows 7 on this computer but as I tested it's not going to find that one Windows found problems with your computer startup options do you want to apply repair and restart your computer first let's view the details so press tab okay now that one is active so enter okay it found a Windows 10 virtual hard drive whatever let's just close it and repair and restart let's see what that does and press enter now Windows is trying to repair something now I'm not going to boot from the optical drive but instead it should boot from the hard drive itself and the default operating system is starting so nothing was damaged so that's the repair option of the Windows 7 installation kit